Pristina Airport, uh, MiG-29 flying down to check out the Macedonian border crossing and then straight back to the airport over Pristina. Quite an overcast day and so I'm going to fly heading 150 to the border down the valley and let's see how it goes. Positive rate of climb, flaps up, neutralise that trim, great airport here. Sigmund 007 continue for north departure. Mike into your golf copy. Pristina Tower Migman 007 continue for north departure. Migman 007 leaving my airspace frequency change approved. Mike into your golf copy. Pristina Tower Migman 007 frequency change. So I just want to point out there's our mine just north of the runway and power station off to the right. You can see the chimney and the uh, big cooling tower. Pristina's over there. Okay, let's, let's turn around. Fly back over the airport, heading 150 180, 170, 16 Yep, there's the airport, so we'll fly over the airport then Turn left to 150. Time is 9.39 a.m. Very overcast. But what are we about? Um, about 1400 feet above the ground. If we can stay down below 1000 feet, we'll be able to follow the valley quite easily. Down to the, uh, the border crossing. One of our regular scrambles from Pristina. Okay, there's the airport, buzz the tower, as is obligatory. There it is. Landing light off, turn to 150. Spot on. And we'll keep it low. So we don't get lost up in that haze. We've got problems with the uh, INS at the moment, so we're relying on dead reckoning. That should be fixed in a couple of days, they tell me. 400 knots, uh, about 600 feet above the ground. Let's push it down a bit. 400 feet. And we can see the V-shape straight ahead, the dip in the hills. Let's move the hut. There we go. That's where the entrance to the valley is, going to the Macedonian border crossing. And, of course, we've got that tall mountain right in the middle of the frame up there, next to the compass, at about uh, 1 o'clock. And we know that if we go directly west from there, we get to the, um, the cross border crossing with Albania. But we're not going to do that today. So, 450 knots. Also, I'm going to tune to the, uh, the beacon at the airport. Just do that now. It gives us a range at 12, 13 miles. So about another 10 miles before we enter the valley. It's 23 miles from the airport. So that's another handy way to uh, work out where you are. And this river and road we've 
looking at now they lead right into the valley so now actually let's follow them for a bit about 450 feet above the ground it's fairly flat most of this valley floor that Pristine is on but starts about 1700 feet at the airport and it goes up and down a few hundred feet what well, we're down to 250 feet over that hilltop right now we're entering the valley and yes we are 21 so by the time we get in there it'll be 23 miles from the airport up closer and it's going to be right left right left right right come around the left probably too fast there another right coming up and the left And then border crossing, we can see it now already, a little bit right around this um, ridge. Very gloomy, but here we are. Oop, watch the towers, but there it is, there's the truck stop. Let's turn, I won't pull up into the clouds. Maintain 300 knots through this turn. The 3G, need more juice, down to 250. Still sitting on 3G. Back to 300 knots. Okay. Could flow back up the valley, I guess. Yep, here it is with the elevated roads, pretty cool. To the right, pretty tight corners there. The left. Watch the speed. Right again here. And this should be the last one, I think. Yes, left coming out, back out into the main huge valley that uh, Pristina sits in. So looking for the reciprocal of 150, which is going to be about 330. And from past experience, if I don't get on track right now, I end up blowing right past the airport. So it's 20 miles away, around 330. Right, reset that heading. And 326. 330. Right now, let's crank it up. And we're 17 miles from the airport. Which I will pull up on the radio. Channel 2. Channel 2. Mike India Golf 4 Did we get through? Didn't get through Pristina oh, Tower yeah. Migman 007 is 15 miles southeast 3,400 feet with India to land 
Admin 007 Pristina Tower. Altimeter 29 decimal 9 2265 at 8. Make straight in runway 35. Mike and Deer Golf, copy. Make straight in runway tree 5 Migman 007. Okay, we've got visual on the airport, it's about 10 miles, 9 miles out. Migman 007, wind 265 at 8. Clear to land runway tree 5. Mike and Deer Golf, copy. Clear to land runway tree 5 Migman 007. Okay, so we'll just do a visual approach and we'll do a break over the airport. Yeah. A nice quick landing. Yeah, a little bit right. Okay, let's uh and of course we've got special permission to fly this fast simulating wartime conditions well, I got the throttles right back but it uh, just keeps keeps on going and going downhill getting down to 500 feet that's good so we'll end up turning way past the, the terminal there which they're probably glad of still be noisy Okay, let's do our brake turn. There's four or five G's there. And yep. Yeah. Somewhere between the terminal and the tall hills on the right there. Watch your altitude. Have my trimmed out. Right. Okay, so what are we at? Uh, 400 knots? No, oh, quite slow now. Right, gear down. Flaps one. Power up as we turn to final. Very close. Anyway, let's continue. Yeah, that's a pretty tight landing. Touchdown. Now I'm going to put the brake chute out. Two brakes. Let's drop the chute at about 40 knots. Shoots away. Uh, air braking. And we can zero, zero, seven, turn next taxiway. Turn off the runway here. Okay. Migman zero, zero, 007 contact ground on one tree four decimal minor seven five. There we go. That's a pretty exciting landing. And just another day at uh, Pristina.